Well, special day today. I want to thank all the folks on Facebook, too, on my page there. Uh, wishing my wife, my lovely wife, Susan, a happy birthday today. Uh, there's with her daughters and granddaughters, and I'll tell you, and her mother, Nana, right there, having a celebrating birthday party over the uh, weekend. It was a great party. It was a beautiful birthday party for my beautiful wife there today. Uh, we can see some showers there occasionally on the Van Wezel webcam moving off into the Gulf of Mexico. Occasionally, uh, and then some breaks in the clouds and some sun there occasionally. We'll look for that uh, through the uh, day tomorrow, too. Not as much rain tomorrow, it looks like, although we will see a chance for a few passing showers tomorrow. A little drier air will slip in. You can see these showers moving very quickly off to the west on that east to northeast wind at 15 to 20, gust to size 25 to 30 miles an hour. And this uh, may hold together and eventually move on in through Arcadia. And then places to the west, we have a lone shower just south of Venice that popped up uh, just recently. So a brief shower, not out of the question. It will stay windy uh, through the 11 o'clock hour. Temperatures in the mid-70s uh, by 11 o'clock. And currently at the airport, we have 81 degrees. Dew point at 71. East and northeast winds at 20 sustained now. And a pressure 30.06, which is fairly high. And the high today was 85 degrees, a couple degrees below average of 87. 95 the record. And uh, only two one-hundredths of an inch of rainfall so far for the month of October. Uh, typically, this is uh, starting to get a little dry pattern, but uh, not, not so much the first couple of weeks as more showers and storms are in the forecast, and you'll see that in the seven-day forecast. Hourly forecast for Wednesday, a bit more sunshine tomorrow. Highs will be into the upper 80s, right around seasonal averages. And we'll see uh, winds out of the east and northeast up to 15 to 20, gusting as high as 25. The small craft advisory will stay with us on Wednesday and continue on Thursday. Those future winds showing them out of the northeast, even overnight, anywhere from 10 to 20 miles an hour at times. And then on Wednesday, things will start to pick up in the afternoon and evening up into the 20 mile an hour range. I mentioned some gusts as high as 25 to 30. Well, down south, we're watching this area of concern now. This is in the southwestern portion of the Caribbean, which is a favorite area for development. You can see some deep convection developing, a broad area of low pressure already there. The Hurricane Center monitoring this and this area right there. Only about a 10% chance of this developing as it tracks off toward the west. A much better chance of this one developing down to our south. Here's the Euro model. Uh, we've been watching that, and you can see there it is on Saturday. It looks like a tropical storm at this point, but that's over 250 miles west of us. And so if it were here, we would have minimal impacts. We'd still get some rainfall here. Then it kind of scoots closer to us on into uh, early Sunday morning and then Sunday afternoon. So we'll watch it closely. Obviously, uh, the little change to the right would cause some significant problems here, but right now the models are trending a little bit to the west as a result of a high pressure that's building in now over the southeast United States. There's the forecast uh, path and track, at least for the next five days. If it were to develop, a 60% chance of it developing in the next five days with that one. So we'll watch it very closely. What we will see, though, is an increase in moisture availability and a better chance for showers and storms. For boaters, winds will be out of the northeast. Unfortunately, brisk out there, 15 to 20 knots and a moderate chop in the bays. And the waters, the uh, seas will be up to 2 to 4 feet. The UV index will be an 8 tomorrow and the water temperature now at 84. Tides are coming uh, for Sarasota Bay. Low tide at 647 and another one at 643. Sunset at 714. A few passing showers. Breezy, 74 for a low tomorrow, 88 for a high, a 20% chance for showers and still windy. And then the rains move in beginning Thursday and they stick around through the weekend.